In the world of automotive innovation, Tesla is once again at the forefront of the conversation, but not without its share of controversies and challenges. The latest developments highlight both advancements and setbacks in Tesla's ambitious journey towards full self-driving capabilities and the much-anticipated Cybertruck launch. At the heart of Tesla's technological drive is its full self-driving FSD system. Recently, Elon Musk made bold claims that FSD version 12.5 could potentially operate for an entire year without requiring driver interventions. This represents a significant leap forward for autonomous vehicle technology. However, alongside this announcement, Musk revealed that Tesla is approaching the limits of its hardware 3 system. In 2016, Musk confidently declared that all new Teslas were equipped with the necessary hardware for full self-driving, even specifying the ambitious goal of achieving Level 5 autonomy. Level 5 autonomy would mean the vehicle can drive itself under any condition, without human input. Yet, it became clear that HW3 might not be sufficient to meet these lofty goals. As a result, Tesla introduced Hardware 4, a more powerful onboard computer. Despite Musk's initial insistence that HW3 could achieve full self-driving through software updates, the company has shifted its focus. Tesla has now prioritized HW4, with the latest FSD updates being rolled out exclusively to vehicles equipped with this newer hardware. Musk stated that while HW3 would eventually receive the same updates, it would require significant optimization to run efficiently on its hardware. This shift signals a departure from Musk's previous assertions, underscoring the challenges Tesla faces in delivering on its full self-driving promises. Hello EV fans, welcome back to EV's gallery. Hope you guys are doing well. From the latest industry updates to in-depth reviews of the hottest EV models, we are here to keep you charged with electrifying news and insights. We are thrilled to announce the launch of three exclusive membership levels on our channel, Spark, Voltage, and Gigawatt. Are you ready to supercharge your support and join an exclusive community of like-minded electric vehicle fans? Become a member of our channel today. By joining, you'll not only fuel our journey together but also unlock fantastic perks tailored just for you. So, if you haven't subscribed yet, now's the perfect time to join the EV revolution. Hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to turn on the notification bell to stay charged with the latest updates. In another chapter of Tesla's ongoing saga, the Cybertruck is back in the spotlight. The futuristic vehicle has captured public imagination since its unveiling, but the reality of its range capabilities has disappointed some fans. Originally, Tesla touted impressive range figures for the Cybertruck, which have since been scaled back. To address range concerns, Tesla has introduced a range extender, an additional battery pack that fits in the bed of the truck. This extender promises to boost the dual-motor Cybertruck's range from 340 miles to over 470 miles and the Cyberbeast's from 320 miles to over 440 miles. However, the introduction of the range extender comes with significant trade-offs. First, it occupies about one-third of the vehicle's bed space, reducing the Cybertruck's utility as a cargo vehicle. Second, the cost of the extender, initially leaked as $16,000, adds a substantial expense for owners seeking the promised range. Moreover, Tesla has confirmed that the installation and removal of this battery pack must be handled by Tesla service centers, as the extender is structurally mounted for safety in crashes. This requirement further complicates the use of the extender, as it cannot be easily installed or removed by the owner for occasional use. These developments underscore a broader challenge for Tesla. While the company continues to push the envelope in terms of technology and innovation, delivering on promises has been a persistent issue. The move to prioritize HW4 over HW3 for FSD updates, despite previous assurances, illustrates the difficulty of predicting technological requirements in an evolving field. Similarly, the Cybertruck's range extender highlights the challenges in balancing technological advancements with practical usability and consumer expectations. Meanwhile, in the broader automotive and energy sectors, companies like Cummins are making strides in sustainability and safety. Cummins has announced the construction of a massive new dyno room for alternative fuel testing, a $16 million investment reflecting the company's commitment to safety and innovation. This facility aims to improve testing for various alternative fuels, showcasing the industry's broader shift towards sustainability. In Texas, the push for environmental responsibility takes another step forward with initiatives to recycle solar panels. 
As the adoption of solar energy grows, so does the need for responsible recycling of solar panels to mitigate waste and environmental impact. This effort reflects a growing awareness of the life cycle of renewable energy products and the importance of sustainable practices. In conclusion, Tesla's latest developments highlight the complex dance of innovation and expectation in the automotive industry. While advancements in FSD technology and the Cybertruck's capabilities hold great promise, the road to realizing these innovations is fraught with challenges. Thank you so much for joining us today. We love hearing your thoughts and insights, so don't forget to share your comments and feedback in the comments section below. Your engagement means a lot to us, and it keeps the conversation going. If you enjoyed today's content and want to stay updated with the latest news, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. That way, you won't miss out on any future updates.